Hello everyone and uh, yeah, welcome, welcome to a new episode of Hashtag Playing Together. Hi. Hello, we are the Southern Knot, the Johan and Desi, and today we have David, who will play with us and improvise with us. <laughs> Hi David. Hello, how are you doing? Fine. <laughs> how are you doing? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Where are you zooming in from? I am zooming in from the United Kingdom, just outside London. Okay. Sounds like a nice place just outside London. <laughs> well, yeah, not that London isn't a nice place. There's a lot of nice places in, in, in the UK, so... Yeah. <laughs> of course. This, this is a nice one. Buckinghamshire, if we want to be specific. Buckinghamshire, yeah. Yeah. Okay. The share, is that like... Um, like in the Lord of the Rings? Uh, yeah, I'm so pleased you said that. As soon as you started that question, I was hoping that was how it would end. Um, but no, it's not, as, it's not as nice as the Shire in the Shire. Lord of the Rings, I'm afraid. Yeah. There are no magical rings. There are no... Oh, no. Yeah. Do you have these little uh, houses? Our, our doors the... are circular, yeah. so yeah, that, that's helpful. You know. Oh, okay. And there's only occasionally. Well, we have. We, be, there might be a dragon, but it's usually like the George and the Dragon Pub. So. Okay. <laughs> Good. Um... So, Johan is waiting. For, are you waiting? For... I'm waiting for you, Daisy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, do you have a, a lot of rain there? A lot of rain. Yeah. Does this it is rain? It's the UK. We invented rain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we okay. we have we have rain uh, all the time, and like when it gets to the summer, like in the UK, it's one of our things that we will we will be like, oh, it's really hot now. We're too hot, and then it will end, and it'll be a day later, and it'll be like, oh, summer's over, and we never get used to any weather. So, but, okay, but I guess there is something you like about rain, right? There must be something. But there is something comforting about rain like one one of my favorite things and this might just be a reflection of me uh is as a personality is that if it is raining outside and i am inside yeah. one the sound is very comforting and two it just makes me feel more secure in that well i can't go out and do anything today so it's okay for whatever i'm doing inside if i'm not doing much yeah. just the fact that it's a rainy day outside seems to make it okay oh we don't benefit the rain enough here in, in Belgium. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. It's a nice thought. I mean, you can uh, put in these uh, long YouTube uh, videos of 2 hours and 15 minutes with sound of rain. Oh, I do. You do I that, do. yeah. I love it, yeah. yeah that's yeah. very special, yeah. 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 There's storm, storm that are really storm. good. <laughs> I once had uh, one with um, a Boeing uh, airplane. So you oh, had the right. sound, so you like an intercontinental flight, and you were all the time, or the sound of oh, a, exactly. yeah, yeah, or the sound of a train. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's uh, yeah, it's some that it's relaxing in some way. So um, yeah, See, as, as soon as I get on a plane, I will hope that it's a plane that's got like movies that you can watch, <laughs> yeah. and I will just have headphones in straight away. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's do uh, some improv. Yeah, we are going to build a little story together uh, based on a suggestion from the hat. So, uh, yeah, let me pick one. So, uh, okay. <coughs> I know this one. Uh, this is one from Alexander Ivanchev. And it's what two window cleaners see in an office building. Oh, wow. And they see a CEO drying his or her underwear. Drying. <laughs> okay. Wow. Yeah, okay. I thought so too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's it. So, uh, have fun. <laughs>
William. Would you say that's a scratch? That's definitely a scratch. Well, I've just been cleaning this. We clean this every day. There was not a scratch here yesterday. Are you sure there was not a scratch yesterday? I think I know this quite well. I know every pane. I know every piece of glass. There was not a scratch here. But when I think about it, I think you were the one who was actually dealing with these windows yesterday. Yeah, there are, one, there are a thousand glass panels here in this office building. No, 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 no. no. John. This one. John. Yeah. Why is that scratch so important for you? about pride it's about you know this isn't just this isn't just a, a pastime you know I, I i do this because because it means a lot to me you know the, the, these these panes of glass uh, they're like my children i mean i admire that in you john still remember 10 years ago you were a little guy i know and now you're a big guy. Oh. I learned you the profession. How Indeed. to clean every window. How to see every small spot. Yep. How to eliminate you it. Yep. You promised me you'd pay me one day, but you know, we don't get everything. But that's why it's so important that we make sure each one is well maintained. And look, all I've got in life uh, uh, is this glass. And. Hang on a minute. Now, uh, normally I just try to uh, see my own reflection, you know, not to pay attention to what lies within. Uh, but William, you you, you may no, want to no, you no. may want to take a look at this. No, yeah, you know what I told you? Never peep inside, because oh, things well, you uh, see can be very disturbing. I know it's, that. It's uh, it's very. Oh my! Oh, oh God! What is she oh, doing? Uh, William, William, uh, try, try, try to resist, try to resist. Remember, remember what you taught me, uh, yeah. like day one. I remember. Focus. Focus on the glass. Just see 30 centimeters in front of you, not behind it. Look at your reflection and see the face. Oh, I see a lot more than a face. <laughs> no. Oh. John, don't look. Oh. It's privacy. Oh. William. Oh, she's. I, I think we do need to address. We have to hide. Oh, she, oh, she, she, look, she, look, she sees us. Excuse me. Uh, hello. Knock, 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 knock. Yes, you, you, you. Hello. Oh. Hello. Hey. Oh, hello. <laughs> okay. I have an important date. Oh, you do. Yes. And I. Oh, it's a very important day, and uh, I either have to wear my grandma's underwear, and which will make me look fitter. Yeah. Or I can I can wear the sexy one, <laughs> this one. Oh wow! You know, for later, but it might not be later if I look like. Whoa. You know. <laughs> Well, that's uh, that's uh, quite a, a predicament. Uh, normally, I just uh, clean the glass, but it's uh... you're a guy. Well, uh, what, what, what's 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 the uh, person you're meeting like? He he's he's gorgeous, and his body is amazing. He's a bodybuilder. Oh wow. Uh, he has a wonderful sense of humor, and uh, his wife is a supermodel. His wife? Yeah, I know. Oh dear! Oh, I didn't no. know. Oh. I didn't know he was married at first, and I, I, I just fell in love, and uh, I'm such a bad person. I'm awful. I, I'm a monster. Wait, wait a minute. You, you say he's quite big? Yeah. 
D does he drive a Porsche? Yes. Well, I, I, th I, th I, think, I think he, uh, think he's arrived. I, I think he's coming up now. Uh, uh, I, I don't want him seeing me like speaking to you about your, 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 your nether wall, what you may call it. Which one? Tell me which one. Uh, well, uh, the, 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 the big ones. The big ones. Okay, the granny. Yeah, the granny ones. You know, just, just do what granny would do, and you know. Wait a minute. You said his, his missus is a supermodel. Yes. Is she blonde? Yes. Oh, is she she's there with him. She's coming up too. Oh no. I, I, I fear there could be some sort of drama. Drama. There could be a dilemma here. Okay. Okay. Whatever. Do you think he's probably she's found out about you? Okay, but how do I look? Well, you you, you look good, but I, I, you might want to get out of there. She's got a baseball bat. Oh, okay, yeah, but what? Uh, uh, they're going to make a scene here, right? In in, in the office, in the, the office building, in front of my colleagues. So, uh, uh, oh no, I, 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 I. Quick, cl climb out, climb out with us. Okay. Okay. I don't know where William's gone. Right. So if we just, oh, I know, William, William. Yeah, I'm, I'm hiding. <laughs> Well, well I, I need you to do a favour. This, this. Oh my God, she's wearing her grandmother's underwear oh. on her head. Yeah, right. because I'm a window cleaner uh, now. Uh, well, you, you, John, you need I... to go into. You need to go into this window. You need to climb in through the glass. You need to. You need to confront these people. John, this Listen. is what I, what I. John, this is what I told you about all t that time. Do not get involved. Oh. Oh, but with this, with this. Deep and, in there, and now you invited. A woman here, outside. It's just even not in short. Willem, right? Willem. I, I have never... Uh, I, I, I have only uh, spoken with him, you know, online. Uh, I said my name was Maria. Maria. Can you go inside and you can say that you are Maria? That's a genius idea. Okay. Okay, I will, I will do that. But why? Right. Why should I do it? To protect you. Yes, because you, you you're such a such a huge guy. I am a yeah, huge yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you could do this. Okay, I, I will go in. I I will save you. Okay. I, I'm not sure why I'm doing this, but it's against right. my principle. But I will do it. We'll we, we, we'll wait out here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Right. Oh, hello, I'm Maria. Oh, you're Maria. Yes, I'm Maria. Oh, well. <gasps> Is that her? Is that oh, her? Uh, yeah. Oh. I, I, t I told you. You know, uh, you don't really look like your picture, darling. She's so gorgeous. She's amazing. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, she's a real stunner. But look, look. You know, I just. I've got to come clean, you know. I'm a, I'm a bit of a I'm a bit of a player, and Alex, I've already got a supermodel girlfriend. Alex, you have hurt my feelings. Oh, you never said you were a player. Well, you but, know, when you look like me. Yeah, and I I understand him. He's so so hot. But my but husband, yes. how how is your name, dear? My name yes. is Teresa. Teresa. Yeah, Teresa. 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 I had such romantic feelings, and we, we, Alex and myself, we talked so much with WhatsApp, a Facebook Messenger, and on Instagram. Oh, it's so oh look, uh, Teresa. I think I need to. I think I need to let her down, like gently. If you could just give us, just give us a minute, and. I can tell her that I, I, I won't be able to see her again. I love you, honey. Oh. I'll do everything for you. Okay. Well, you Listen. have a nice wife, Alex. Look, she's an absolute psychopath. She she, 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 she she will cut out your spleen and eat it. Oh. So, you know, you, you, you can't... You, you, you need to... Look, I'll tell you what. But, Alex... You, you don't quite look like your picture, but I feel this real connection between us. I, I, I think... 
if we can just get away from her. If we can just, like, flee, you know. You mean you and me together? Yes, you, you want and me to, together. You want to leave Teresa? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll leave her, like, immediately. It'll just be the two of us. I have such a surprise for you. I, I'm wearing grandma's underwear. Oh, <laughs> just like in my emails. <laughs> yes, I know you like it so much. <laughs> oh, quick, quick, she's coming back, she's coming back. Just play it cool, play it cool. Okay, so I actually have um, an offer for you, Maria, right? I was just yeah. saying, and that is why I can never see you again. Yeah, yeah, we yes, will. But I, will... I feel kind of guilty about my, my what my husband did to you, and I would offer you something. You might thought it's a little bit dirty. Would oh, oh, well, well, this is uh, this feels like girl chat. I'll, I'll leave you. Would you like to, to, to clean our house? We need a new cleaner. What do you think? Uh, salary. It's a good salary, yeah. P yes. Yeah, perhaps in the evenings. As you prefer. If you prefer the evenings, yes. Yeah. Um, Teresa, are you, are you not angry? Ooh, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I was so afraid you would be angry. Um, no, 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 no. I just want you to come to our house and clean it. Yeah, uh, of course. I, I will go to your house and clean it. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, just give me an address. I will be there uh, uh, tonight at 8 <laughs> p.m. Yes. Thank, thank you. Uh, See you tonight. Okay, I have to go now. Okay. Yeah. It was just a little bit little misunderstanding. Yes. Uh, bye. See you tonight. See you tonight. Bye. Oh, I think it's working. They're, they're leaving now. Oh, sure? this was my this was worrying. It's still. Oh, William, how'd you get on? I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm just happened? not. Just not an actor, yeah. I, I never. Play the woman. I, I, oh, well. but, but I don't think she noticed it. Oh, that, that's good. That's, that, that's good. Yeah, I think you got away with it. I, she's expecting me yeah, to do some cleaning. What? You, you mean you got to meet him again? Yeah, tonight. Yeah. And, and, oh, the, and the big guy, he wants yeah. to run away with me. <gasps> so if I. Well, that should have been me. I will run away with me. No, no, no actually with me. I, I have the, the, the grandma. What, 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 what about the win, window cleaning business? Well, I can't do this on my own. There's, there's like 10,000 panes of glass here. John, well, I kind of liked cleaning the window. Yeah, yeah. I think I have an idea. For me, I think after so many years, John, I think you can run the business on your own. Or, or with... Well, someone else. We, yeah. we, we could give it a go. And I must say, I, I really fancied the guy. Oh. I wouldn't mind to run away with him. Oh, it, it did look like he had chemistry. There was. I mean, have you seen the chemistry through the window even? I oh, thought I was, like I was flabbergasted. Yeah, I was flabbergasted. Yeah. I, I thought I would sink through the, to the, through the floor. Oh wow! Yeah, well, I never I, felt I that before. I don't think the cleaning business can can get in the way of true love. Yeah, probably. I, this is. I just need um, the underwear because oh. it, it really fancies grandma's underwear. Yeah, but see, I use the underwear to clean the window, and uh, oh, it yeah. looks very good. You can you can get the, the the sexy one if you want. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's better than nothing, I guess. Okay, guys, well, good luck with the business. Yeah, good luck. Yeah? Uh, and let us know, send a text later how you get on. <laughs> yeah, I will. Okay. Bye. Bye. I... <laughs> wow, what? Wow, look at that. What is he? Yeah. I... Look, look at us, we got a... I, I, really, I really hated my, my job. It's so boring. Yeah, now you get to look at them through the window. Yeah, and laughing at them. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, some of them are staring, so, you know. 
John, I would like to ask you something, but you have to be very honest. Oh, oh no, I promise. You know, I'm always honest. Do you like my my underwear? Well, I did. I did. I didn't want to say. I mean, like a a woman's grandmother's underwear is her own domain. But I mean, if if the if the if the, if the like the the bodybuilders out the way, I I, I must say there's. There's a certain appeal to it, you know. There's a certain, you know, musky odor which it feels homely. It's almost. It's almost 8 p.m. Hope she can clean the house and have have. <laughs> Grandma's underwear with me. <laughs> yeah, I can't wear that. Oh, hey. oh hello. <laughs> uh, I, I'm. Uh, thank you. I, I'm so looking forward cleaning your house. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that. I know yes. that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so where is Alex? Oh, he's busy. He's busy. <laughs> he's at the gym. <laughs> Oh, oh, I was really hoping that I could be able to uh, have a chat with him. Oh, yeah. no, you, you know, are not going to be able to do that. <laughs> well, Alex and me, you know, we still have a little bit of loose ends. Uh, we, 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 I've told you about the WhatsApp conversations we had. They were so, yeah, the intimacy was Help unbelievable. Me. Uh, uh, TV, TV series. Oh yeah, I like television yeah. as well. Yeah, uh, do you have a cold, my dear? Help me! <coughs> What's yeah, that? Oh, that's from the, from the TV. Don't worry. It's. Uh... Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It really hurts. Yeah, it's it's a horror uh, TV series. Cold, it really hurts. <laughs> you will be able to, to watch it and then participate in it uh, in a way. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I I, I, uh, I like to see sometimes horror movies, but with two. So we can okay. hold hands. I'd like to oh, offer you yeah. a glass of tea. Thank you. So, how's the date going? And send. Oh. Wonder if he's gonna get it. Also, I'm a little bit freaked out by the underwear. It's it's grandma's and it's bringing up lots of disturbing thoughts. I'm hiding. That woman is completely insane. She was after me with a knife. Can you imagine that? I'm hiding under the ch under the stairs. I'm coming to send a message to John. John, please help me. Please, please. She's coming. Hey, She's Maria, where are you? No more knife, I promise. <laughs> I have something better. No, no, please not. Oh, just a moment, darling. I've got a text come through. Oh, uh, please help me. She's coming. Well, I, I don't know if I want to know anything like that going on. Uh, we're having a bit of a nice time here ourselves, aren't we? So anyway, uh, good luck with it. And let me know how you're getting on later. Okay, then send. He's just going to leave me here. Uh, that's, that's, oh, is that... He's dancing like a ballerina. <laughs> nine, 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 one, one. Hello, hello. Are you calling the police? I've no battery anymore. Watch, watch it. You stay away from her. Be careful, darling. She, she cut my arm off. It was an accident. I wanted to cut only your finger off. You call that an accident? Not my whole hand. I, I can't bench press anymore. Oh, I don't want to have anything to do with this anymore. No, don't. No, I... It's time we came out with the truth. I'm going. Uh, here. No, uh, take it, me with you. The house is locked, so you cannot leave. Yes. You've got to stay here. You've got to stay here. We've got to make a stand. We've got to stand up to her. 
<laughs> Look, I want my arm back. And furthermore, I'm against... furthermore, just you, just you listen to this. I'm, I'm against violence, Alex. I, I can't do anything about it. That's not violence. This is how I express love. Yeah. That's how you express love by chopping a man's arm off. I said I'm sorry it was an accident. Oh. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm still leaving you. She is twice the woman that you are. She's... She does things for me. She... She wears the underwear I like. Show her. Oh, no. Oh, no. She must really love you. Yes. That's true love. Everything for Alex. Everything. I cannot stand on the way of the true love. I'm sorry. My mistake. It's me who is going to leave. Go. Yeah. Go. Yes. Okay. Bye bye. Oh, oh. She's gone, Alex. Oh, I was so afraid. You saved me. How oh, is your arm? Oh, it's 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 bleeding out quite a lot. I I expect I probably need some help, or I don't have much time left. I, I let me use the underwear of Grandma to tie it up. Oh, that's a good idea. There we go. Okay. Let's oh. stop the bleeding. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Alex, do you really want to? To go away with me. Yes, I, th I, I think we should go. Yeah. We should go before before uh, she changes yes. her mind. Alex. She, she's done this before. I mean, I, I didn't want to Alex. mention it, but you may have noticed I've only got one foot. Oh, is that the reason? Yes, is that we got just as far as the driveway and she came back with a sledgehammer. Is that because you were dating another woman when you lost your foot? Well, I am a player, like I said. Oh my God, Alex. Alex, I have to be. I have to confess something to you. Oh yes, what yeah. is that? I, I wasn't entirely truthful when we were chatting on the internet. No. Uh, I'm a man. What? Oh. I'm. I'm Willem. You're Willem. Yes. Is that a problem oh. for you? Well. Uh... Oh, I, 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 no, not, not really. I mean, oh. it, there's something I, I, I need to admit as well. I know you, Willem. John called me. He said that if you didn't get out of the window cleaning business soon, you'd be there and you'd see your whole life waste away. He just, he needed you to make this step to to branch out on your own to find someone and yeah. I was hoping that could be me. I found you. Oh, it's me, Willem. Oh. Let's go away, Alex. Okay. Let's go away. I... Oh. Hello. Uh. So, um... I... I feel you don't like my grandmother's underwear. Wait a minute. Hang on. You're the one from the internet. You're the one that looked like the picture that Willem didn't look like. Yeah, it's me. And then the John... I'm chatting with him. He doesn't like my grandma's underwear. Oh, well. It's an acquired taste. And... and this is my grandma. I look Whoa. more and more like her. Yeah, no, like you know, gram She 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 brushes up well, you know. Well, and this is for, her underwear. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, you know, for those octogenarians, they'll 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 nip and tuck everything nowadays. I I really like John. You like John? Yeah. Well, you know. I think the final piece of this puzzle, now that, you know, Willem is, you know, he's with me, I was hoping that somewhere along the line that he'd find someone as well, but maybe if he's, if he's not into the underwear, maybe there's, there's, there's something else. You mean? I do. Oh. oh That's right. Yeah, you are extremely intelligent. Well, and beautiful and everything. <laughs> well, you know, I, I, I well, yeah. I, 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 yeah, this is uh, 
That's even hotter, actually. <laughs> okay. Okay, but look, me and Willem, we're, 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 we're going to be leaving soon. Yeah, I saw the chemistry between both of you. Don't worry, I understand. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I've, I've got a good feeling if if you want John, then you just go get him and, you know, you, you text him right now saying you'll be there. And I will text him the, the photo of my grandmother. Oh, yeah, that's... You know, if you could text me a copy as well, then, you know, okay. okay. Right. <laughs> Done. I, I, I just need to, because, you know, the blood yeah, and everything. Okay, yeah, you're kind okay. of losing blood. Thank, Thank you. you. End scene. <laughs> <laughs> oh <dear. laughs> I wasn't sure if you would initiate another scene with. Uh... <laughs> it was about uh, like my my hat swapping was a little bit slow. Okay, I yeah, I waited, I waited. I thought, okay, probably the end, and yeah, what will happen now? We will never know. Yeah, but... it's, in, it's in our imagination. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> You got this one. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's, yeah. yeah. Many thanks, David. I, I really enjoyed it. It was so fun. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of fun. <laughs> so, David, tell us more about your improv journey. When did you start doing improv? Okay, I started doing improv about 15 years ago. Um, and then I, st I was doing improv in some shows then i went into drama school and training there and whilst at drama school i started the first version of what has now become uh, extreme improv and so that started in 2010 and then we did various different shows and we, we did the show called extreme improv in 2017 and it was the one where people really liked the format people wanted to do that show again and more of that and so eventually it was like okay well the show the, the whole thing should just be extreme improv from this point onwards and so with that really extreme improv was born was it offline or online oh yeah no it was it was very <laughs> offline this was like the, the interesting thing is before before there was like lockdown and everything we'd yeah. been doing a podcast version of the oh. shows so we'd already worked out about how would different improv games and formats work just with audio so then when we were transitioning things to zoom everything that works for audio would work on yeah. zoom so it felt like we were actually like a step ahead of other people trying to figure out oh what games work what what formats do and don't work how do we like do these different things because we could make everything work just for audio it was then doing it on yeah. zoom was a bonus that we could play the same things but also be seen a little bit yeah. as well you said that in 2017 extreme improv then was born uh well as a name by the name you had already in 2010 i guess but um well no before that it was called the improdigies ah, like okay. we were the prodigies yes but we were the improdigies yeah. and it was a hard name for anyone to spell people would read it they yes. couldn't pronounce it it was like this is this was a mistake and so when when the opportunity came up with something as simple as extreme improv yeah which people have said like how is this extreme at times and they expect us to be yes. set on fire or like dangling from buildings and it was more that a lot of the games we do because we'll do our main show is a short form show it would just make things more challenging so there'd be tight time limits or more restrictions yes. on games to make it sort of like what people are familiar with but tougher Okay. And therefore, extreme. And you wrote a book about that. I did. I don't know if I've got it to hand. Normally, I do to show people, but yeah. it's called the Extreme Improv Big Book of Improv Games. If you bear with me one second. Yeah, of course. Just buried it somewhere here. Mm, where is it gone? Here we go. So, it's the Extreme Improv Big Book of Improv Games, which okay. explains how to play over 100 short form games. There's nice. pro tips for all of the games, so that. And they're applicable across all of improv. So the the lessons it teaches you, you can like use in more than just the individual game. Uh, there's illustrations. There's a little bit of like history on the company and everything at the beginning. Yeah. Um, and yeah, it's available on Amazon as paperback or as a Kindle edition. Yeah. Yeah. So 
That's awesome. I didn't know you wrote a book and the first time I see it. So uh, now it's great. So 200, 200 formats. Okay, so it's got, uh, it's got what, 104 games in there, but it's got hundreds and hundreds of like tips for, okay. yeah. like, for all of the different games and it's got loads of like basic like basic rules it's written in easy to understand language yeah. so that someone who so i think everyone should like I, everyone who wants to do improv or watches improv if they want to have a go they should be able to do it and sometimes i feel that in improv we get a little bit of technical terms and language which make it intimidating for people to from the outside world especially if they're not even actors yeah to jump into okay yeah yeah that's true i agree uh so do you prefer like game shows or also long format shows i personally i prefer prefer short form i think i've got a lot of i've got an awful lot of thoughts i won't bore you forever with it though but i think when people most people know what short form is a lot of people don't understand what long form is mm -hmm. the interesting thing is long form is actually easier to explain because long form is it's an improvised play or it's an improvised musical it's a musical without a script or a play yeah. without a script that people make up and that is pretty much explained what long form is when it comes to short form there's different rules there's different games and challenges and each one has its specific quirks and it's a lot more difficult to explain but I think the reason why short form has more wide, uh, wide, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, mainstream appeal, rather, yes. widespread appeal, is just because you can watch it in short little chunks. Whereas it's difficult if someone doesn't know what a long form play is, they'll look at it. You can't. You need to kind of join in from the beginning to start getting the characters. Like when we do it, we may be able to grab a hat or a prop near us as we're doing it here. But on stage, um, you know, it's a blank stage. Yeah. It, there's no props. There's a lot that the audience they need to concentrate a lot more with it. Yeah. Also, I think for for online improv, perhaps the short form is uh, a bit better as well to grab audience attention, because like a television, yeah, you people zap around from one thing they to another. So, uh, well, so, so, so if you can bring something in two three minutes, and that's it they have seen it all but uh yeah to grab the audience attention for half an hour one hour uh in a long form play especially on the internet online in zoom um it's that's really hard it's easier on stage when the audience go to the theater and they are basically locked up and can't leave anymore <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. So that way you, you kind of get their attention. Yes. Or at least you hope. Yeah. <laughs> you hope. <laughs> the worst you thing. Organize, you organize a lot of jams. Is that true? <laughs> we do an awful lot of shows. And so the shows that we do online, they're, they're kind of like jams in that um, rather than it just be completely so that people can just say, oh, I want to do a game. So it will be formatted more like a show so that it'll be like. Um, you know I'll, I'll say what the games are going to be and then we'll play it but it's it's all super relaxed yeah it's all very much with the idea of like it's it's effectively like a, a jam environment like we we do competitive games but it's never it's the furthest thing from genuinely competitive it's all just about having fun especially during lockdown and everything there's it keeps people creative it's, it's something fun people like to watch it as well so you know it's got this community feel to it all. yeah yeah now these shows if you do them uh, you broadcast them on on facebook uh youtube.com forward slash extreme improv then facebook twitch basically anywhere where, yeah. where we can broadcast it you also have a website yeah www.extreme.tv yes we uh, well, just launched this two weeks well last week in fact okay um it's extreme like 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 where how you might watch a live stream s t r e a m e d with an x at the beginning so extremed dot yeah. tv and it's got like a netflix of improv show so when you guys did our uh, our festival last year yeah. your show will be on there oh okay uh, so we have a section of guest shows so your nice. show will be on there for people to find yeah 
and so it's like a Netflix of all of our shows. We've got like our podcasts because we do several podcasts a week, and then we've got like a, a big new thing is that we've got articles, and it's not just about improv. It's got articles about movies and about uh, travel and video games, just Ooh. things that we think people will enjoy because improv itself isn't necessarily about anything. Because we didn't know that our show today would be about looking through a window and stuff like that. So improv is the is the way we do it. But then what it's about. Yeah. Um. So we've we've got things on there that we think people will enjoy. Okay. I actually seen a lot of you, uh, of your shows of your game competitions. I don't know how to call them. And sometimes I would steal uh, an idea about a game and use it with my students. <laughs> do it. Do it. That, that's what they're there for. Anyway. Um. Do you, do, do you have a do you have a, a game which you liked that you stole out of interest? Well, well I, I cannot I cannot recall it right now, but somewhere I have a list. <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 uh, it's, it says from uh, extreme improv because I just need to know where I found it. Yeah. yeah, no, that's cool. No, it's it's always cool. Like again, like one of the things I put into the book because when I started writing this, I was like, I think I've made a lot of these games up, but. I, sp I specifically say in there, I think I made a lot of games up, but because I don't know that someone else hasn't come up with them, I'm not going to say which ones, but then if, if there's someone out there that's like super nerdy that wants to figure out the origin of every yeah. game, and then it's like, well, if I wrote about it first, it's probably mine, but <laughs> otherwise. <laughs> I think it's a great book that also for teachers, yeah, like this is doing, yeah. um, just to, yeah, do things for your students, which, yeah, I, all help is welcome, I think, in, in general. Yeah, absolutely. Think, yeah. That, that's, it's a resource. Nice, nice. You are also a radio yeah. host, right? I am, yeah. There's a, a radio station in the UK called Tring Radio, mm -hmm. uh, T-R-I-N-G Radio. Yeah. And it's, a, it's an internet-based radio station. They're about a year old or thereabouts, so once we're out of lockdown, we're hoping that we'll have like in-person studios but we've got people from all over the country who present different shows and I present shows on a Wednesday and a Thursday uh, on it so it's lots of fun banter and chat and lots of fun music as well nice uh, yeah just sent sent the link yeah so uh, people can find you on the internet when you do your radio show because uh, yeah like we said before we went live you're the first person I know doing radio shows it's amazing <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's really cool it's fun and, and it's it's quite improv like as well because just that because you're presenting you're like yeah. you know it's it's talking but you have a, like a rough idea of what you're going with but you want to keep it fun and bubbly it's very improv like yeah yeah really good um anything coming up soon um if you want somewhere yeah yeah so like with, with the launch of the new website we also announced a bunch of new shows that we're doing yes. we've got new shows over this week and next week we've got and some of them are slightly they they've all got improv in them but some of them are slightly other things as well so tonight we've got a show called geek battle on at 7 p.m uk time which will focus on some games challenges quiz elements um, drawing elements, music elements, all sorts of things, but all based around anything kind of geeky. So it's going to be very focused nice. on Star Wars, oh, Lord of the Rings, Harry Potter, <laughs> the Avengers, that kind of stuff like that. Uh, then we've got um, a similar sort of show based on professional wrestling tomorrow. Oh. Then we've got, no. uh, yeah, so that's the Slam Jam wrestling <laughs> show. <laughs> and so that's what I mean. And that earlier you asked me about it's a jam, and this one. There was a song released in the 1990s about wrestling called yeah. Slam Jam. So I just took that name, and now everyone thinks it's an improv jam. I'm like, no, it's, not an improv. <laughs> it's just the name of the show. But then we have a poetry slam next week, oh. and we've got a joke telling stand up show this week as yeah, well. Yeah. Oh, God, so much. You're so busy. All of these are uh, on Extreme Improv YouTube channel, right? That's right. Yeah. yeah. I yeah. really like the picture of your shows. They always look, I, I, it makes me feel like I'm in um, in a game, you know, in a computer game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah well, that's, that's the vibe I go for. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Good. Um, so, yeah, we will put some links on our page too. Yeah. Um, and if you think, oh, uh, I would like, 
that they also that or that or that link or upcoming things just just send us a little message and we put that on on, on the page as well so uh, that we can awesome. share all your work and the great things you were doing uh in the community so um that's awesome yeah no, thank you okay um yeah so um that was it i guess let's uh i will bring us offline so everyone many 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 thanks for watching <laughs> david don't go away um i will just bring us offline but uh yeah, yeah. see you next time bye bye bye, bye.